Welcome back. Embrace of the Serpent has backed the Golden Peacock Award of 46th International Film Festival of India. Music maestro A.R. Rahman was the chief guest for the IFI closing ceremony. Legendary filmmaker Nikita Mikhailko backed the Lifetime Achievement Award, while Best Actor was given to Viset Lido. Best Actor Award was given to five actors for the film Mustang. Goa government has fulfilled the demand of the Bharatiya Bhasha Suraksha Manch. Education department has decided to release one-time grant for upliftment of Marathi and Konkani medium schools, which are open after 2012. The Directorate of Education has written to 30 schools asking them to send details of the schools. To release one-time grant for upliftment of Marathi and Konkani medium school, the Directorate of Education has returned to 30 schools across the state asking them to send details of the schools as per the format prescribed. This grants comprise of one-time grant of 12 lakhs and maintenance grant of 5 lakh rupees to be released over a period of 5 years with 1 lakh rupees per annum. 57 primary schools were opened across the state after state government had introduced the medium of instruction policy in 2012, out of which only 30 schools have requested for one-time settlement grant for school. BBSM had earlier demanded immediately release of grant for Marathi and Kokni medium schools. Reporter Mahesh Ghadi for Prudent. The High Court has granted bail to convict Anand Baburao Gawas in Bichuli's Pramila Gawas dowry murder case. The court has granted him bail on a personal bail bond of 25,000 rupees. Anand Gawas is before the High Court challenging order of the Panji District and Sessions Court, sentencing him life imprisonment along with three other co-accused. Convict Anand Baburao Gauss got a relief from the High Court on Monday when the court granted him conditional bail. During the argument before the High Court, prosecution did not oppose much for his bail. The court ordered him to release on personal bail bond of 25,000 rupees. Anand Gauss has filed appeal before the High Court challenging his conviction in Bicholi's Pramila Gauss dowry murder case. Anand Gauss is undergoing life sentence. According to prosecution, victim Pramila Gauss was admitted in GMC in critically burned condition on 23rd June 2011. Pramila Gauss had stated to the doctor who was treating him that her in-laws set her on fire for dowry. After a trial for four years, the Panji Session Court had awarded life sentence to convict husband Prakash Gauss, brother-in-law Anand Gauss, mother-in-law Anandi Gauss and Jayanti Gauss. Mukesh Kumar for Prudent. Let's take a short break, stay tuned.